sisters and brothers in Jewish communities around the world. Yom Atzma'ut Sameach. Happy 73rd Independence Day. 73 years is a short time in the life of a country. We are still building our modern state in our ancient homeland, a state that is Jewish and democratic, democratic and Jewish in the same birth. At the same time, and you are all full partners in this effort, Jewish and democratic state. Over the last 70 years, I have had uh, the great privilege of learning from you. I deeply admire the strong spirit of Arvuta Dadit, mutual responsibility, which characterizes so many Jewish communities. And I deeply appreciate the diverse expression of Jewish identity. Our sagas told us to follow the school of Beit Hillel, because Beit Hillel truly listen to all sides. These lessons should serve as a guideline light for all of us. We must always truly listen to all sides. We must remember that we are one strong, big, and diverse family. We have a shared destiny. A new Israeli and Jewish hope must be based on unity and diversity, on mutual understanding and shared experiences. At this Independence Day, and in the last month of my term as president, I am proud, I am very proud of all that we have accomplished together. From Tikva Israelit to the joint delegation of Israeli and Jewish leaders to Africa from expanding both Israel experience programs and programs of four Israelis opinion leaders in the Jewish communities all around, abroad and here in Israel. Together, we are combating anti-Semitism, making Jewish education stronger, and promoting Holocaust remembrance. Yet, while we have come far, there is still so much more we can do. I want to thank all of you for all that you do for Israel and the Jewish people, for being side by side with Israel, for defending Israel, for defending Zionism, and the Jewish people. This place, Beit Anasi, will always be your home. Thank you. Thank you from the bottom of my heart. And as we say in Hebrew, Todah Rabah Sameach.